I hit your phone like, what's up when you try and get this sex from me? You know I don't mean no disrespect. Hey guys, it's Naira. Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, what's up? What's up? Today I'm bringing you guys a super cute clothing haul with Falofa. They have super cute pieces and they specialize in like trendy pieces and Y2K clothing and all their stuff was so, so, so cute. And I'm really excited to show you guys. The website and everything that I'm showing you guys will be linked down below. This video also is going to be a styling haul. I'm not only going to be showing you guys the pieces and trying them on for you, but I'm going to be showing you how I style them, how I'm gonna be wearing them, what outfits, give you a little bit of outfit inspiration too. You're welcome. So yeah, let's get into it. This first item is going to be this super, super cute, very like Y2K cropped graphic tee. It says, why are you so obsessed with me? Mean Girls is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite movies in the entire world. So when I saw this shirt, I was like, oh my God. Like I needed this. I. I needed this in my life. This shirt is going to be so easy to style and so versatile. Like you can wear this with a bunch of different things because the color is so cute and so bright and so fun, but it's just so simple. And yeah, I really love it. I styled it with these sweatpants that are from my store and they say explicit on the booty. So the pinks match really well and they both give major Y2K vibes. Like this cropped graphic tee with the lettering and like, the bedazzled booty, they both gave so many like Y2K vibes that when I first saw this shirt, I was like, no brainer. Like I absolutely already know what I'm gonna style this with. The material is really good. As you can see, it's not thin, not see-through. Again, you cannot see my nipples and that's important to some people. I don't care, but it's important to some people. So yeah, you can't see my nipples in this. I feel like Regina George in this outfit. Like I feel like I'm about to tell Katie Heron that she's a less hot version of me and I'm gonna go make fun of Janice Ian. Like, that's what I feel like right now. Next, we have this beautiful black dress. This is literally something right off of somebody's, like, dress wish list, a Pinterest board for dresses. Like, I'm not even going to say too much about this dress. I'm going to let you guys see this dress in the try-on. Honestly, this dress should have came into my life sooner. This dress is a game changer, okay? As cute as it may look off, you'll see on the try-on portion, it's even more cute and sexy and adorable on the body. Okay, am I not giving you Pinterest, girly? Am I not giving you, you saw this dress on the Pinterest board? Is the body not giving my body shape like Jeannie Waste's teeny booty dreamy? Because I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. Tell me if I'm tripping, tell me if I'm crazy. But those are the vibes that I'm getting from this adorable ass dress. My booty looks good. I mean, it always does. But my booty looks good in this dress. And honestly, the detailing, like this little strap detailing with these flowers, bro. Oh my God. I feel like my boobies could be a little bit bigger to fill in like these little cups that I outlined. However, what am I gonna do about that? And like my breasts aren't gonna fall out, so it's fine. That's just me, you know, that's just, that's just on me. That is on me. As I was putting this on, I literally said to my sister, I wish I would have had this package before my birthday because this would have been my birthday dress. Next, we have this adorable, this adorable, like super Y2K white mini skirt. And like, I feel like Y2K was the time of the true mini skirts. Like these new skirts, they're mini skirts, but they're not mini skirts. This is a mini skirt and I appreciate a good true mini skirt okay this skirt takes me back to like the early 2000s when i was still a child like i just feel like a y2k celebrity walking the red carpet in this skirt you'll see in the try on it is so freaking adorable and so y2k you guys this skirt is giving me such strong y2k vibes not me being britney spears not me being ashley tisdale on a 2008 red carpet i love this it is so cute and so adorable it's not see-through so you can feel secure. Things that like strap, like wrap around like this are so in right now. If you wanna hide your belly like me, you can move it up a little bit too. But things that wrap around your body are so in right now. And this skirt is like, I don't think I've seen the skirt exactly like this that like cinches and then pleats out. Like I don't think I've seen this skirt literally anywhere else. I'm in love. The skirt is short, but who cares? It's 2021, show a little bit of booty, you'll be fine. This is so cute. I'm in. 
Next, I have this super, super, super adorable two-piece tie-dye set. Tie-dye is so in right now. It has this super cute skirt that scrunches on one side, so it is a little bit asymmetrical, which is so freaking adorable. And then the top is kind of like hard to display here, so I'll let you guys see it in the try-on portion. Like, you'll see in the try-on. But the material is good. The print, is this, this technically isn't tie-dye print, but whatever the hell print this is, it's really cute and looks really good on. You'll see in the try-on, this is, so sexy so adorable it's giving me like ig model on vacation look like an ig model walk with a waddle body shape like a cold bottle you know this is what that's giving me so obviously this is a whole set doesn't need to be styled so i'm just trying it on for you guys it cinches here on the side and it goes like asymmetrical and then it cinches in the middle as well like up top when you tie it and it is so cute it is short but i like short I'm really feeling this for like a vacation. Like if you're going on a vacation, you're gonna be on the beach. Honestly, I'm a bad bee anyway, but this hour is really giving me like bad bee vibes. This is gonna slap so hard on the gram too. I have to get a picture on this. I know I say that about everything, but like when you're a content creator, baby, you gotta get the content. So I have to make sure I get a picture in this because I feel so sassy. I feel so sassy in this. <laughs> Next, we have two items that I'm going to show you guys together because I did style them together because they both gave me like that chill vibe. First one is going to be these denim shorts. You cannot get a good pair of like decent denim shorts from anywhere. And I got lucky. I sourced us a good solid pair of frayed denim shorts. You're welcome. The denim on these is actually good quality quality you don't gotta worry about sitting down and ripping your pants because you got on cheap ass denim you know what i mean and it frays so adorably and yeah these are just so 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 cute and they're not like too 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 short i like a pair of short shorts but i don't always want to be wearing coochie cutters and these are the perfect length like they're not coochie cutter oh my god are you going to the club in those this is a family event you probably shouldn't have worn that like they're not that short but they're also not too long like you get a good breeze you show a little bit of body, a little bit of booty, but they're not too short. And then also I styled it with this hooded like pullover basically. It's chocolate brown and it has pink letters printed on it that say play with my emotions. Very cute. I styled these both together because they're like both very chill. They give me like the same vibe. You know what I mean? So yeah, I'll show you guys a try on for that. Am I giving the girls Ariani? Is it giving Ariani? Right, I got my half up, half down. Did it give Ariane? Did I give Arianka or no? So these two things I decided to start together because this is what I would wear like on a chilly night. Like me and my sister go night swimming. So like if I throw something on over my bikini to just go night swimming or if I'm like just, you know, going somewhere cute for the evening, like a spring, summer afternoon slash evening, I would throw something like this on. So yeah, obviously this is not like the fit that you stunt on them hoes in. This is like, I'm chilling, but I'm still really cute. So I guess you can stunt on them hoes, okay? You determine what kind of fit you need to stunt on these hoes. And then this little like hooded shirt says, play with my emotions, but don't blow my emotions. It's just a shirt. If you play my emotions, I will beat your ass. Okay, so yeah. Next, I have this super freaking cute pair of lavender purple tie-dye shorts with the drawstring. This is so cute, right? Like out of everything that I'm gonna show you guys in this video, I think that this is going to be my favorite piece. It, I mean, it already is. Like I want to live in these next time i have somewhere to go like probably later on today when i just run out of the house to like go grab something from the store i'm going to throw these on like these are so cute because i feel like they can be super chill like to just throw them on or you can see in the try on portion like i dressed them up and like made them a fit you know what i mean not me being a streetwear pinterest girly all right so these adorable freaking shorts are probably my favorite thing in the entire haul like i'm not even joking i'm kind of obsessed, kind of in love. Love this for me. I paired it the way that I would style it and that's with this little shirt. Honestly, I always do something a little scandalous, a scandalo. It's just in my blood, okay? I can't help it. Yo no sé por qué. Pero I know that this is so freaking cute. I would wear this if my boyfriend's like, let's go get ice cream. Or if I'm just like running to the mall real quick. They're really thick. 
the tie-dye looks really nice and i mean my booty is just my booty so of course they look good in them and the very last piece that i'm going to be showing you guys this adorable white top i know this shirt does not look like that girl when it's off but i'm gonna let the try on portion do the talking like this shirt this is a main character shirt baby like i know it's simple but when you see the way that i styled it especially like mwah, chef's kiss this is probably my second favorite thing in the whole haul but you can't get a good feel for it when it's off the body. So let's just, let's cut the talking with this one. Let's go straight to the try on portion, okay? Okay, so this white top, I styled with these pants because I was thinking like, of course I could do this with like a cute skirt or like a dainty cute little pair of shorts or something. But I like to like mix and match styles because like, I don't know, I'm just a mix match kind of person. Like, I don't have one specific style. I don't only dress this way or that way. So I like to take things from multiple different styles and put them together. And so that's what I did here. These jeans obviously are a little more like streetwear, like a little more like edgy, a little more like, you know, like streetwear Instagram baddie. And this top is very much like, I don't know. This top is very like casual, but it can almost give you like cottage core vibes or like super casual going to the beach vibe as you can see the shirt is not see-through which is a big deal if you're like me you're part of the itty bitty titty committee you don't wear bras like i do not remember the last time that i put a padded bra on my body no i'm just not going out in a bra so it's important to me that the white shirts well i'm not gonna say it's important because i don't give a damn it's important to other people that white shirts don't show your nipples and this is solid your nipples are not showing thank you guys so much for watching i have a blast doing try on hauls for you guys as i said the website and everything i showed you guys will be linked in the description box below if you enjoyed this video leave me a like so that more people can find it and comment down below what your favorite piece was my favorite pieces were the lavender tie-dye shorts and that white top that i showed you guys last Mwah, chef's kiss i actually saved my two favorite things for last i never do that I usually show like my favorite stuff first. So that's weird. Follow me on Instagram to keep up with all my escapades when I'm not filming YouTube videos. I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah! Bye!